Hey guys, I'm Samantha Heifel. I am sitting here with Teen Wolf's Shelly Hinnig. We are going to play some Super Smash Brothers and occasionally talk about Teen Wolf when we're not beating each other up. Yes, it's gonna get really aggressive. Okay, Shelly, you wanna pick first? Who you wanna be? Yes, uh, I'm really stressed out about that, but I think old fashioned Mario. Okay. Can we agree that Little Mac looks a little bit like Tyler Hecklin? Wait, where's Little Mac? Oh my god, he does look like <laughs> Tyler. That's amazing. <laughs> where's He's the freaking. Tyler Hecklin look-alike to help? <laughs> Just around. Um, wait, I'm sorry. The, the Desert most, Wolf. Is yeah, this going to be a big plot point I this hope season? so. Malia is motherless, and uh, I think she'd like to figure out who that person is, regardless if she's good or bad. Um, you know, if she can handle who a real father is, and I'm sure she can handle uh, the mother, the desert wolf has to be better than, than Peter. Than Peter. I feel like we also, we thought Peter was dead. Peter was Whoa, dead you at just, one point. Yes, and you just did this awesome slide move. How? I have no idea. Wait. Time. Do you want to choose our next location? Oh, okay, okay, okay. We already went to the Bahamas. Final Destination, I didn't like those movies very much. I was Ooh, in those movies. Luigi's Mansion? I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> For a second, um, I was like, oh my god, what she? No. Three, two, one, go! She likes uh, being at Styles' place, and, and Stalinsky and her, I think, have a good um, relationship. If I must say so myself, I think she is uh, perfect material for Styles, and Stalinsky would only be so lucky to have Malia as a daughter in law. <laughs> now that Stalia is obviously in the <laughs> shipper universe, have yeah. you had any crazy fan shipper experiences? Um, you mean in the past or with Stalia? With Stalia. Is that how you say it? Stalia. People Stalia? say it like Stalia. Is that how they say it? Get with a game. Yeah. <laughs> I, people are, yeah, they love it. I mean, of course they still love Stidia. Um, mm -hmm. Maybe they can all three get together and be one happy family. I don't know. Um, be like one of those three. I mean, it is couple. 2015. It's a lot more accepted. That's true. Uh, but I'm 0%. I'm very intrigued because the finale revealed that Brayden obviously is a part of the Desert Wolf storyline as well in like some way, shape, or form. Yeah, she's sort of our go-to uh, detective, <laughs> if <laughs> you will. Um, and I love that uh, she's badass, um, very much like Malia and and uh, Kira with their fighting skills. Yeah. I'm, I'm all for strong female. Um, uh, characters in which we are not. Yeah, in we're we're not that. But I'm thinking about getting Peach, and maybe okay. it'll help me step up my game. I really want some like Malia Braden scenes, yeah, especially with, great. The, with the Desert Wolf storyline. Yeah, I'd be really into that. I'm I'm into it. Because Braden's such a tough chick as well. Yeah, she is um, with an amazing body. Um, and I love that everybody else has to get naked except for me. I'm usually the one that's, you know, well, you, you then again. You realize that you're now going to have to get naked this Right, season. right. <laughs> Why was I talking about Brayden's body? So weird. Three, two, one, go! Where did this <laughs> dog like come dog from? on our screen. Why is he in a yoga studio? <laughs> Who brought their dog? How do you get rid of him? I, I mean, know. he's cute and all, but I can't really tell what's going on. Maybe that's the point. They're trying to distract us with a cute little dog because they think we're little princessy we're females. <sighs> this game. Okay, so let's also talk about April 17th. You have a movie coming out, MTV, yes. Unfriended. Yes. I made the mistake of watching the trailer at my desk. I'm so sorry. The other day, and it, was not, it wasn't great for the people around me. <laughs> were they just really confused? <laughs> they were really worried for my well-being. Yes. But tell us a little bit just kind of about the premise of the movie. Yeah, it, they're not lying when they say it's a new genre of horror. I think it's a new genre of film, really, yeah. because the whole movie, you're literally watching my character's desktop. Right, as it's if, like Skype. Yeah, uh, sh as if a girl comes home from school, decides to Skype her best five friends, and decides to press record. And it, it kind of highlights the online bullying and the hacking and the scary things that happen on the internet these days. Well, sadly, we lost the third round as well, but we both kind of win at life because Shelly has her movie Unfriended <laughs> coming out in April, and Teen Wolf returns in June, and I get to watch both of them, so I win as well. So thank you, Shelly, for being thank here. Thank you. It's not been a bad day. <laughs>